Every fast food chain you know and adore has a secret menu. For example, open the KFC app, go to the menu, swipe down and hold for exactly 10 seconds. Canal Sanders will then start to gradually appear on the top of your screen. Click on the invitation and unlock the secret menu. In every other case, you unlock it by just going to the employee and asking for it. So KFC automatically top of the fucking game. Starting off with McDonald's, 13 secret items. That's a lie, because when it comes to the Mac 10 and 35, the Mac crap and the Mac gangbang, they're not secret ingredients. They are just not, they're not secret items either. They are literally two super normal orders you're making and then you kind of like engineer your way. So it's about 10 items and we're gonna start with the Big Mac Chicken. Now the Big Mac Chicken is what you get when you order like a normal Mac Chicken and you just ask to put some like Big Mac in the middle of it. And that's it, F tier. Now, the two cheeseburger meal, big fan of that. Now, when it comes to the Big Mac chicken, all you're really getting is like two burgers in one. But when it comes to the two cheeseburger meal, you're getting two burgers in one. Because you're straight up just asking for like another order, but free, B tier. Big Mac sauce fries, order like fries, normal fries. And then instead of like ordering ketchup as a sauce, you just go to the employee and you do be like, actually, you know what, I feel like, maybe just for today, maybe just for today, you know, like a little, little try I'm giving here. Maybe, we wanna try with like the Big Mac sauce. Which is not a sauce you have like available per se, unless you order it in a Big Mac, but they certainly have it. Which is tricky and sneaky, and I like it. C tier. Okay, now we're getting with the Land, Sea and Air Burger. You gotta appreciate the Avatar reference. You gotta appreciate it when, when you see it. But it's still kinda lazy. I don't know, it's like D tier. McKinley Mac. What is the McKinley Mac? Oh my god! Oh my god, okay, okay, fuck, I forgot about it. The Mick, oh, this is stupid. This is, this is so dumb. Because what you're doing, what you're doing, basically, you're taking like a super normal Big Mac, okay? You're taking a super normal Big Mac. And instead of like putting the normal patties, you put in the ones directly from like the quarter pound burger. You, you. I'm not feeling enthusiastic about it. I'm not feeling like I'm going to a fucking adventure because I decided to do that. This is F tier. Now the Monster Mac. The Monster Mac is like a Big Mac, but instead of putting two parties in it, you put eight. And this is S tier. The Mac Leprechaun Shake, it's simply just available in March. It's not even that big of a secret, but who cares? It's, it's still like time limited. Time limited stuff is the best stuff. Because it's not supposed to be bought whenever you feel like buying it. It's special. You could only buy this fucking motorcycle. You could only buy this in a specific period of the year, which is so much greater than everything else. So Mac Leprechaun, 100% an A tier. Neapolitan Shake, F tier. You order a normal milkshake, and at the question, and excuse me, like, what flavor do you want? You literally just answer yes. But the Pie McFlurry, now the Pie McFlurry, A. You're ordering a McFlurry. And you know, instead of we like going with the Oreo one, instead of going with the, like the Reese's McFlurry, the M&M McFlurry, you go like, you know what, I want a McFlurry, and then you put two slices of pie in it. Who the fuck ever came up with that? It's kind of like if I'm going to KFC and I'm like, I would like a Pepsi, and then just put me like a, a Happy Meal inside it. You know what I mean? It's like, maybe they'll do it, but who the fuck would have supposed you would have actually ordered it? You know what I mean? Burger King has about six, six, secret items but maybe there is some shit like <laughs> the burger king blt which kind of sounds like a k-pop band i'm not gonna lie okay what is so special about this okay no s and, oh no, fuck, for fuck's F. You take a normal Whopper and you ask just to put some bacon on it. You know what's the audacity in asking this? Cause I don't. It almost feel more like outrageous. I don't have an example yet. What a, this is so damn. This is so dumb. Yeah, sorry. Could I have some more bacon on my Whopper? I'm really feeling like I want to eat some more meat. And this is the big secret? Big secret is not The Burger King Club is kinda like a chicken sandwich, but you get to put like bacon and tomato and cheese in it. Okay, this is cool. Okay, this is, okay, B tier. The Burger King ham and cheese. Okay, S. Cause this is no modification. This is straight up something just S. So like the Burger King ham and cheese, by being like a whole other order, technically is the only secret order we've had so far. Prince, A tier. The balls. 
honestly. It's kind of like when someone asks how you're doing, how you've been hanging up lately, and your answer is like nothing much, which kind of makes sense. But who the fuck are you? You can see the logic, but let's be honest, if you didn't know it was a possibility, you probably would have not considered it in the first place. Mustard Whopper. Oh, no, this is not the one, is it? No, 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 you fucking me. Oh, so fucking fuck, fuck. Okay, not gonna do that again. This is so dumb. This is so dumb. Okay, okay, okay. Now listen, you gotta understand a thing. Right? I was so pissed off at the idea of like a McKinley or a, or a big chicken, a Mac chicken, whatever the, fuck the name was. Because I was like, you just you you just taking something and you replacing it with something else. Mustard Whopper. You take a burger, the Whopper, the single most generic fucking shit Burger King could have given you, which is super good by the way. But see, like you taking a super normal Whopper and you just go. Um, actually, no mayonnaise, please, just put some mustard in it. It's like, oh, oh, are you, are you feeling spicy today? This is the worst I've read so far. If I'm coming with, if I'm going with you to a Burger King and you ask for like mustard instead of mayo on your Whopper, that's no problem at all. And you know what you do, you, cause you're a, you're a, you're your own human being you're your own unique and special individual and nobody could ever tell you anything against because everybody deserves a chance because everybody brings something that they put on the table but if you call it a secret menu item if you actually call this a secret if you think that this is a spicy way to get around the system if you feel like you you're breaking the metrics because you're asking for mustard instead of mayonnaise you, you deserve to not hang around people whenever someone will tell you that you're a unique human being you'll have to correct them you'll have to look them straight in the eye and go no no i'm not i'm a normie i'm a fucking normie i know nothing about anything about shit about uniqueness about specialty i don't have a quirk i just have a sad sad life where i cannot ingest mayo but only master because that's what you are so anyway master 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 whopper definitely like ftf for me yeah yeah it's gonna be an f Rodeo Burger, Rodeo Burger. For me it's an A tier, cause the Rodeo Burger was like an official menu order you could get years prior. And then it disappeared. You're ordering something that you know that they technically don't do anymore. Yeah, the order discontinued, but did it? Rodeo Burger, honestly, A tier. Suicide Burger, this is S. Veggie Burger, you like going, fuck, I wanna go back, vegetarian, and you kinda get in it, so. A bit here. Okay, okay, getting closer to the 10 minutes mark, so I'll be speeding up things quite a lot. Build your own bowl is kind of like hot pockets, but put some more stuff in it, so D tier. Poutine uses KFC ingredients to make a poutine B tier. Triple down is kind of like the double down, which was already super fucking unhealthy, and KFC decided to respond to all of the allegations by tripling down, <laughs> which is just undoubtedly the best course of action they could have done so ATF for that. Buffalo chicken sandwich easy C tier. Just put some hot sauce on a spicy sandwich. Chicken quesadilla is a quesadilla with chicken in it. Go fucking figure. D tier. Fried chicken club is a fried chicken sandwich but less cancerous. D tier. Spicy char is a chicken sandwich but spicier and oh my god so original right? Blueberry cheesecake milkshake. It's kind of like the pie McFerry, only that in this case they use a cheesecake instead of a pie that melts in the milkshake. Absolutely fucking A tier. Free ice cream. Okay, no, S tier, 100. Okay. Oh my, oh, this is so big. Whoa. You're going for like a kid's meal, which is supposed to have a fucking toy in it, because you know, capitalism. And then you trade the toy for the ice cream. The toy was not yours in the first place. They give you something and you give it back to receive something. You're getting two times what you are. You, you know what I mean? It's like, it's like if you had to give me uh, a bill, like a one dollar bill, and I was like, by the way, can I trade this one dollar bill for like your five dollars bill? And you're like, yeah, happy to oblige. It's like, I gained something out of something you gave me. I never had that one dollar bill, but now I've got a five dollar one because of you, you fucking moron cretin. Okay, this is S tier, easy. 
The barnyard is a burger with meat, what kind of meat? All of them, sit here. The Grand Slam has a really cool name, a bit here. But then you realize it's just a normal burger with some more parties than normal, which is just stupid and does not deserve such a high standing, so F tier. And then the Wendy's foie gras burger, S tier. Cause let's be honest, how many times can you go to a drive through and order goose liver burger? I'll tell ya, never. Chick-fil-A definitely was the worst. Because you know the single most amount of like D tiers. And then we've got Wendy's, then Burger King, and then McDonald's. Yeah. 